Hi everybody, bonjour tout le monde. How's it going? It has been a day. That's all I can say. It's just been a day. So, we are uh, going to wait for a few people to come on. Je vais attendre pour quelques personnes. I'm looking around because I'm hoping to see something that I've been looking for all day. So how's it going, everybody? Hello, Marise. Hello, Karen. How you get? Salut, Colette. All right. Well, I don't see what I'm looking for, and that's sad. But the good news is we have ATC cards today, and I'm going to show, take you through Lawn Fawn. And there's some really cute Lawn Fawn. And I know I have the sample cards here because I just saw them. And now they're hiding from me. Anybody where the sample cards went to? Oh, my goodness. I'm looking around and Francine's standing here just doing her own thing. Puis c'est elle qui les a placés quelque part. Donc, c'est un journée pour elle aussi. OK. Donc, bonjour tout le monde. Salut. Comment ça va? Oh, Vicky, I'm so glad you're enjoying it. Hi, Jacqueline, Karine, Sylvie. Hi, everybody. Vero. All right. So, first, let's do some ATC cards. Jacinthe was here today. Elle avait des belles cartes, puis elle a beaucoup de réservations, mais il m'en reste quelques-uns, deux ou trois, puis de celles-ci aussi. Très, très, très jolies. Donc, ceux-là sont disponibles. Aussi, aujourd'hui, j'ai eu de Marise La France, ici. Euh, elle avait un batch comme ça, des robots faits avec des produits de... Euh, Marlène. Je suppose que ceux-là étaient d'un batch aussi euh, qui reste un, un. Et voilà. On a aussi quatre de cette gamme-là. OK. Et aussi aujourd'hui, on a eu de Brigitte. Un batch de Brigitte. OK. Donc, vraiment beau. Donc, merci tout le monde qui envoie les cartes. Et les filles que j'ai reçues aujourd'hui, je vais vous envoyer votre batch qui attend vous ici. Et ce que je fais, je ajoute celle qui manquait. So, OK. Voilà. So, ici, ici. Il me manque une. Je l'avais cinq. Francine? I had five. <laughs> OK. Donc, je vais vous montrer les cartes en premier. OK? And then I'll show you the beautiful lawn fawn stamps and dies that made these cards. So this one... No, I need it closed first and then I'll... <laughs> This is their interactive card, okay? So watch how cute this is. Tu le mets dans l'enveloppe. You put this in the envelope like that. And then when the person gets it in the mail, they sit it down, push like that. Et voila, you have this beautiful card, okay? So this is a beautiful pop-up card. So encore, ça ferme comme ça. Puis, quand tu l'ouvres, ça va comme ça. Oops. And you try not to pinch it to show it to everybody. Voilà. OK. Donc, ça, c'est la deuxième. La troisième est celle-là. This is the third one. Happy Mother's Day. Then we've got this fourth one. Happy Easter with some of the new papers in the background. And 
Then we've got number five, which is thank you so very much. Okay. Now let's have a look at the stamps and dies. All right. So here we have, sorry, I missed your birthday. I didn't plan it that way. I love that. Okay. My mask doesn't want to stay on. Parfait. Then we have, so that's year 11, okay? Si vous connaissez bien Lawn Fawn, if you know Lawn Fawn well, they always have a year stamp set for their anniversary. So this one is year 11, which was really last year, but with COVID, they didn't end up having it. So you've got year 11. And then here is year 12. Donc, ça, c'est celui-là de cette année. Okay? So, year 12 et le matrice qu'il match. So, this one is, I don't know if it's a bird, a puffin. I'm not sure what it is, but it says squawk. Uh, oh, it's a parrot. Apparently, it's your birthday. C'est un parrot. Parroquet. I knew that. Parroquet. <laughs> Oh, it's been a day. Then we have this one, which is called Rub-a-dub-dub flip-flop. Rub-a-dub-dub flip-flop. Encore, si vous connaissez uh, l'enfant, ça c'est l'opposé d'un autre qu'ils en faisaient ça fait quelques années. So this is the opposite of the original Rub-a-dub-dub. Rub-a-dub-dub was a bigger kit. It was a larger kit, and um, they just took the ducks out and made those in the reverse, okay? So this is rub-a-dub-dub flip-flop and the die. Then this one is tiny farm. Ça, c'est les petits bonhommes de la ferme. Il y en a quelques petits animaux, puis farmer. Farm. It is fermier. Fermier. So, voilà. Et le matrice. And then we've got the berries, how you been strawberries add-on. Okay, for any of you who have the how you been jar, il y avait, oh, ça fait des années maintenant qu'ils ont originalement sorti la how you been. Et il y avait des bonbons, des jelly beans qui fitrait dans le pot. Donc, après ça, il continue à sortir des, des autres choses qui fitrait dans le pot. So, you can use this on its own, but if you have the how you been jar, you can also use it with the jar. Aussi, on a, si vous voulez, remettre les petits, uh, the seeds dessus, Ou vous pouvez mettre un visage. Donc, c'est pour cette raison, ils ont laissé les ouvertures. Comme ça, vous pouvez décider. So, they left it open here. So, you can restamp the seeds or you can put a smiley face. So, all up to you. Okay. Now, the tiny friends. This one is the tiny spring friends. Yes, tiny spring friends. Il avait une pour hiver, une pour anniversaire, une... They might have even had one for Halloween. Donc voilà, ça c'est nos petits amis. And so that's Tiny Spring Friends, uh, encore en à la matrice. This one here is called Better Days. I hope you feel better, better days are ahead. And then just this cute little spring bunny. So very, very cute, easy stamp set. With an, to make an easy card. Voilà le petit lapin. Okay, now, here we have a very, very rainy day. Very rainy day. Et voilà, ça c'est les petits bonhommes qu'on a utilisé ici. So that is very rainy day. Okay. Very rainy day. Et toutes les petits bonhommes, the, uh, the little tiny spring friends, sont ici aussi. So you can see the tiny spring friends. They fit in all the different Lawn Fawn scenes, dans les scènes de Lawn Fawn. 
Then we've got this one here, which is called Garden Gardens Before and After. Okay. And this is if you have, oh, what was the before and after? It was, I think it, it flipped to a before and after, but it also works with the magic iris. You could have on the front of the magic iris, uh, you can have the, the flowers bloom and they can be this on the inside, but this is one of their before and after stamp sets. Donc, soit les carottes qui um, agrandit ou les fleurs qui ouvre. So this is the garden before and after. Et on a le matrice qui va avec aussi. Then you've got this little reveal wheel strawberry add-on. Donc ça c'est pour l'ouverture et quand tu le fais ton reveal wheel, ça va passer ici. Vous allez voir soit une souhait ou la fraise. So that is your reveal wheel strawberry add-on. Ça ici, ça va avec la fenêtre qui est sortie euh, pour, je pense que c'était hiver, le, le sélection d'hiver ou printemps, euh, pas printemps, automne. So these two, win these two scenes fit in this window, which it came out a while ago. So if you want to do it as an outdoor scene, as though you're inside looking out, then there is the window for you. Et ça, c'est les scènes. Et voilà ceux qui coupent juste ça. So if you want to kind of just have your scene, but you're not looking from inside the house, then you would just use this to cut out these. Okay? So that is window scene spring die and window scene spring step. Then we've got our giant Easter messages. Okay, ceux-là sont des souhaits pour Pâques ou printemps. Et ils sont les gros. Il va dans le gros uh, uh, ovale qu'ils ont sorti aussi uh, vers automne. But they always make a new one. Donc ceux-là peuvent aller avec l'autre et ceux-là est dentelé. So this one will give you a scalloped oval. The original was just a stitched oval, okay? And I believe you can put the stitched over this one and one might fit inside the other, but I'm not 100% sure. I would have to try that. These are always popular. Ceux-là sont toujours populaires. C'est les ronds. Ils s'appellent Magic Spring Messages. Donc, il va dans une rond comme ça. Et les autres ici sont des petits images, so les oeufs, puis tout ça. So then this one matches this, but it also goes inside the magic iris. And I think that's what a lot of people use these for, inside your magic iris. All right, the mice. The mice always do very, very well. Everybody loves the mice. So this one is called Berry Special. Berry Special. Okay, and there are your mice. Okay, donc tellement mignon, les petits souris. So this one is called Berry Special. Voilà le matrice qui le match. Okay, then we have You Goat This. You Goat This. Oh, uh, they, they are gorgeous, these. So look how cute those guys are. Ceux-là étaient une des plus populaires dans les commandes. OK? So, very, very sweet. You got this. Et le matrice qui match. Ceux-là, c'est pour ceux qui, qui uh, ramassent les... Si vous avez le tiny gift box et vous êtes une personne qui ramasse toutes les ajoutes, les add-ons pour ça, ça, c'est une... Um, a lamb. Why can't I think of a name for a lamb? And? Agneau. 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 I do know that. But it's a sheep. Agneau. Sheep. 
Acerla c'est une, um, this one is, is a goat. I don't know if it's Billy the goat, but it is a Billy goat. Look at his little, love this here. Un chèvre ou un chèvre? Chèvre. <laughs> we went through this. <laughs> Moose. Moose. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Every once in a while we go off, you know, you know when you think a funny yes, thought? Yeah. Every once in a while we just have these funny thoughts. So here is the stitched strawberry frame, not to be confused with the outside in stitched strawberry. Différent, ok? Je vais l'expliquer. Celui-là, il va faire un cadre. Donc tu vas avoir la cadre ou le cadre autour de ton image, ok? Donc, ça va découper ça avec la couture au centre. So, this one is going to cut you the frame. You'll still, you still have this to, to cut out and your branches, your flowers to make this. But what you will get is this darker reddish frame. The outside in will cut you the whole strawberry or a window of the strawberry. Et les deux vont avoir la couture dessus. So that's how they are different, not to be confused with being the same. So on pas la même chose. Okay. Here is the Magic Iris Floral Wreath Add-on. Donc, pour aller avec le Magic Iris, mais j'ai beaucoup de monde qui achète eux autres. So often people who don't have the magic iris will still buy this and they will just put those round sentiments in the middle. Okay, so they would just put these round sentiments right in the middle of there. Ou c'est un coron. Okay, so it can also just be a wreath. So very pretty. Giant happy Mother's Day. Well, that you saw here. Okay. And all we did here is cut it twice to coupe deux fois, puis mettre une à côté de l'autre. So you just kind of move it over just a tiny bit, and it gives you the look of the shadow. So that is done with that. And the get well soon mem shows. You can do it once or twice. Vraiment à votre goût. Then we've got happy spring. Happy Spring, and of course, Happy Easter. So, all these great dyes. Then we have the Good Luck Line Border. Okay, Good Luck Line Border. Voila. Now, these guys are usually pretty popular, okay? Donc, ici, on a le renard. So, it's called Foxy Family. Et ça fait les deux renards. Okay, so ici, ça se coupe le fond plein et vous pouvez ajouter de, avec de craie ou de l'encre, vous pouvez faire de shading. Was that the back door? Et ça ici, tu découpes en noir et mettre par-dessus. All right, so that is Foxy Family. And then we've got the Springtime Bunny. Même chose, ok? Tu coupes le plein puis le contour. So, and look how cute. You can even put that little hat on, a spring hat. Vraiment mignon. Ok, this is the Reveal Wheel Build a Barn add-on. Et voilà le Build a Barn. Ok? Vous pouvez utiliser le Build a Barn just comme ça. You can use this just as is. And it'll build that. Mais si vous voulez faire le reveal wheel, c'est le roue qui tourne ici. Ça, c'est la fenêtre pour, mettre au, au, pour couper et mettre autour de la fenêtre dans le haut. OK? So that would be like a little frame to put around here. So that would be your reveal wheel add-on. Then we have strawberry patch. Strawberry patch. Et ça, c'est tout. Voilà, ça vous donne les fraises. Et était utilisé ici. Sauf notre panier est toute partie. Je l'ai déjà recommandé. So this basket, this fruit basket, 
is disappeared already. So I have more on order. Voila, we have four, we four leaf clover, clovers. Oh, I can't speak today. Four leaf. Okay, they're just clovers, guys, because they don't have four. Cela est quatre, quatre, quatre. Eux autres, c'est les trèfles, trèfles, clovers. Trèfles. Trèfles. You see, I do know some words. Ça c'est les trèfles avec trois feuilles. Puis voilà celle avec quatre. Et sont toutes avec la couture. So you can do a beautiful little good luck card for St. Patty's Day. Here we've got Henry's ABCs. Henry's ABCs. Donc voilà. Et ça va faire ça avec le petit nom. Et oui, on a le nom en stock. Donc, vous pouvez le faire pour St. Paris Day aussi. Et voilà les chiffres qui matchent. Donc, ça, c'est Henry's 1, 2, 3s and Henry's ABCs. This one is called Spring Flowers Backdrop. OK, ça fait le fond. Il vous donne les fleurs extra au centre que vous pouvez utiliser à part ou même pour mettre une par-dessus de l'autre. So you see, so you could change the colors by just punching. Instead of having to, normalement, si vous voulez changer les couleurs, il faut découper la grosse ici trois, quatre fois. Mais vous pouvez simplement, tout simplement, juste découper les extras puis mettre par-dessus. So that gives you the spring flowers backdrop. Okay, very cute. Here we've got plant a succulent. Et ça fait ces petits bonhommes-là qui sont mignons. And that does these three cacti that you can see in the back. So here is the window frame. J'ai recommandé parce qu'il me restait plus. Mais ça fait la cadre. Aussi, vous l'avez la, le, the rod. Ici, pour mettre les draps dessus. Les draps. Et, then you could have decorative drapes. You know, it's almost like bangs or no bangs. Well, this could be just very decorative right over here. I wonder if they show both. No. Eux autres, ils vous montrent unis. Donc, sans les draps. Okay, so this one is called window frame. Voilà le slimline picket fence border pour ceux qui aiment faire les slimline. Donc voilà. We already have the slimline mountains. Here's one of the fence that you can put on there. Here is the reveal wheel. Just in case you don't have it yet and you really want one, ça c'est l'original. C'est pas nouveau, il n'y a rien qui a changé. Donc, si tu l'as déjà, le reveal wheel, tu n'as pas besoin d'un autre. And then, this is your platform pop-up. OK? Donc, ça vient avec tout, tout ça. Et vous pouvez faire le plateforme. Tu vois le, le chose autour ici? Ça, c'est une ajout. OK? So, I don't want you to think you're missing something. OK? If you get this, like we see here, okay, that is, cette matrice-là, il fait le fond. So it's going to do the bottom. Oui, vous avez tout pour faire la gazon, pour mettre une boucle, uh, voilà le complète de la boucle, pour faire les fleurs, tout ça. But if you want Si vous voulez le dessin autour ou le morceau autour, à ce temps-là, oui, tu as besoin d'une autre matrice. Tu as besoin de ceux-là. So, this is the one. Je vous montre encore, juste pour être certaine. So, I'm going to show you just so you don't mix it up. The bottom part, the one that is the green plaid, diagonal plaid, that is made with this die. If you want to do the border around the top that looks like the sky, 
you need this die. Okay? Donc, il vient en deux morceaux. So, you can. Vous pouvez utiliser juste ça, puis il est encore beau. Mais si vous voulez vraiment comme la, le ciel, à ce temps-là, il faut, faut avoir la deuxième. Next. Here we've got clear glaze. Donc, comme les glossy accents, comme le clear glaze de les autres compagnies, l'enfant a fait une clear glaze aussi. Donc, voilà. And then we have the sparkle glaze. Donc, ça, c'est la même chose. I know it's blurry. I don't know how to get it not blurry. This is the sparkle glaze. Donc, même chose, sauf il y, y a des paillettes dedans. Donc, ça va briller beaucoup plus. This is their new paper line, Flower Market. So, you will have all these beautiful flowers. Les feuilles avec des beaux fleurs et les ray rayures diagonales. Diagonal. I keep turning it over. I'll show it to you in the bigger sheets. And then this one is called their Gotta Have Gingham. They really love gingham. Now, here, it's not as big as it looks on the, on the front, but it's still not a tiny, tiny gingham. Okay? It really is a nice size. Voilà. So this one, sur-là ici, moi, je pense qu'il était pris des grosses, les douze douze. Mais, did they use it anywhere else? No. Donc, sur-là, il, il vient de chercher de le douze douze. So there's that. Then we've got our clover background stencil, encore pour St. Patrick's Day. I'm surprised they don't give you an image of it. J'ai bien surprise qu'on n'a pas même une image faite avec ça. But it will give you la trèfle. Then these are to do diet. So skinny striped stencils. Ils vont, ils vont vous donner les deux. Vous pouvez utiliser chacune séparément. Donc une qui est verticale ou horizontale. Puis une qui est diagonale. Et vous pouvez utiliser la même, les deux sur la même carte. OK? So, hey, is that Marlene here? Marlene, is that you? It must be, because it says Art by Marlene is watching. Hello, my friend, I miss you. Did you see at the beginning when I showed ATC cards? Oh, Marise. Marlene is watching. Look at these beautiful ATC cards. Do they look familiar, Marlene? Hey, did those look familiar to you, all these images? Aren't they beautiful? She did a good job, eh? Yeah, let's see some love, Marlene. Okay, back over here, my friend. All right, so voila. This one is their new Spring Blossoms Flowers. Now, moi, je suggère, l'enfant, il fait toujours des très, très euh, bonnes vidéos en montrant tous leurs produits et comment les utiliser et tout ça. So, I would suggest that you go have a look because they did a lot of different kinds of designs with these flowers. But they are the same kinds of flowers that they used on their papers. Okay, so Spring Blossoms background stencil. And then Rainy Sky stencil. C'est la pluie. Okay. Then we got the pearlescent vellum again. Just parce que c'est très populaire. Donc c'est tout perlé. It's not green. C'est blanc, mais les reflets le fer euh, vert. Barn red. So, Kelly Marie said, yes, we already have a red cardstock, but we now have a barn. So, we need to have the right red for a barn. So, this, hi, Arlene. Hello, Marie-Josée. Uh, so, yes, so this is a barn red, okay? So, they know they are, voila. Now, here we've got... They have names. La couleur Audrey. 
Okay, so this paper is Audrey. Ça c'est les dessins. Okay, then we have Margaret. Margaret. Here we have Bessie. Now, if that is not the name of a cow, why isn't this black and, uh, and white? Okay, I'm thinking they tried to make this a farm-like. So, voila. I apologize if anybody out there, your name is Bessie. I just, because they did the farm cow, that's the first thing that came to mind. Here we've got Greta. Greta. And she should have braids, I'm sure of it. You see right away, isn't it funny how a name makes you think of something? I see a little Danish girl with braids. So, you know, very weird. And Dorothy, well, we all know who we think of with Dorothy, right? Where's Toto? Voila, Dorothy. That's Dorothy in French, in case Marlene needs to know. Then here we have Harriet. Okay, well, I'm not touching that. Voila, Harriet. Okay, voila. Now we go to these pretty names, right? So those were pretty girls' names. Now we've got like Sweet Pea, Honey Bunny, you know, a little springy thing. So here we've got Sweet Pea, C'est les fleurs, et on a les diagonales en arrière. This one is Buttercup. You see, I told you very sweetsy names. Buttercup. Avec un diagonal. Gla Whoa, gladiolus. Gladiolus. Je pense peut-être c'est le nom de la fleur, mais comme je ne connais pas mes fleurs, je ne peux pas garantir. So, gladiolus. Here we've got, oh, I don't like this name. Delphinium. Delphinium. Et je ne sais pas si ça c'est la fleur ou la couleur, mais delphinium. Et voilà les diagonales. Là, on a lupine. Lupine, which I do believe is the name of a flower. Okay? One day I might learn the names of the flowers. But that'll be when I retire and start gardening. Yes, I said the retire word. I know it's a bad word. Et encore les diagonales. Et dernière, brunia. Okay, I have to say, I've never heard that one. Brunia. Ils sont gris. Avec, et les fleurs sont blancs. Et voilà les diagonales. Je sais la couleur n'est pas la meilleure sous ces lumières. But this one is a gray. Vous pouvez acheter aussi le 12-12 en paquet. Flower Market. 12 dos a cis or gotta have gingham rainbow, 12 dos or u cis cis. Whoo! Bye, Marlene. We'll see you soon. Love you. Big hugs. Big, big hugs. All right, guys. So, yes, that was the Marlene from Art by Marlene that was here with us. Donc, a vrai bonne journée. Un bonne journée pour Marlene d'avoir venu parce qu'on avait les cartes faites avec ses, pa uh, ses papiers, ses produits. So what a great day for Marlene to have popped on when, and get to see some, uh, some um, beautiful ATC cards done with her products. Sorry about that. I was reading what Fred wrote. Fred, I'm not trying to hurt you in any way. Retirement is a great word. <laughs> Thanks, Tanya. It's it's great word, except when I use it. When I use it, people start to break out in a sweat. So, merci à tout le monde. Demain, on a des nouveautés encore, parce que j'ai vu des boîtes que je viens d'ouvrir. Donc, reviens demain à 4 heures. So, tomorrow, 4 o'clock, be here. And uh, we'll see you then. I have new products for you. Tomorrow on Friday or Vendredi. For my Maker Maniacs, don't forget tonight is Chit Chat and Cocktails, 8.30. Donc ce soir, pour ceux qui participent en Maker Mania, on a le um, Chit Chat et Cocktails ce soir. Oh, I see. But 
that doesn't, that's not fair, Aaron. What am I going to retire for if he's going to keep working? I think it's the reverse. He can retire and I can continue working. Uh, you're funny, Karen. Fondra D. Wine will be ready. All right, guys. So we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Love you. A demain.